head of the table, the Tribal Chief. The following contest is a tag team Extreme Rules match. Introducing first, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. Holding two championships just comes naturally when you're the head of the table. He defeated Brock Lesnar, Corey, in the main event of WrestleMania to become the first ever undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Yeah, Michael, and you can guarantee the bloodline is waiting in the wings to keep those two titles in the possession of the Tribal Chief. By the looks of things, Roman Reigns is ready to continue his unparalleled domination. Make way for the double champ. And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, The Rock! Imagine all the hard work, the training, and the perseverance it takes to win a title in WWE. Now double it, and you can see the magnitude of this man's accomplishment. In WWE, the only thing more difficult than becoming champion is staying champion. And his journey was twice as hard, but the work from here is double too. But if anyone is up to the challenge, it's this guy. You talk about standing at the top of the mountain, this guy is at the peak of Mount Everest. Indeed, it is going to take a monumental effort to take either one of this guy's titles. Make way for the double champ. And from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Weighing in at 295 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Brock Lesnar! Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. Yeah, you talk about standing at the top of the mountain, this guy is at the peak of Mount Everest. Indeed, it is going to take a monumental effort to take either one of this guy's titles. Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump-inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, one half of the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, the Undertaker. Sinners beware. Your time has come. Enter the Reaper. You 
you could say, daring to confront the Phenom is like digging your own grave. The Undertaker will drag you through the depths of despair. <laughs> when you see The Undertaker, you're witnessing one of the most amazing spectacles in sports entertainment history. Without question, Michael, a merciless force of destruction. When The Undertaker is around, no one is safe. Defined dominance at WrestleMania year after year. One tombstone after the next. Fallen legends, fallen champions. The quest for everlasting life in WWE goes through the dead man, if you dare. Surreal moment here tonight. An awe-inspiring, truly frightening sight. The Undertaker's opponent better get ready. He's about to meet his maker. Expect an incredibly turbulent environment in this Extreme Rules match with Roman Reigns and The Rock. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Brock Lesnar and Undertaker. Such a difficult match to formulate a plan for. Always a challenge to predict the unpredictable. Everyone thinks they can have a plan coming into an Extreme Rules match, and then something goes wrong. Whoever can adjust to this dynamic environment is the superstar with the best chance to win. Nice suplex. Vertical suple. Uh-oh. And he stonewalls the rock. Into a neck breaker. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? Nap time on the island of relevancy. I think he's got it locked in good. I just... He is in serious trouble here. And finds his way out. Oh, well, right hand for good measure. And there's a takedown. Followed by Electra. Counter. And now there's an opening. Oh, my right. And that's some attitude behind it. Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Cole, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics, Cole. Now is the time for these superstars to unleash their pent up aggression and be as violent as they want. There's nothing the ref can do about it, so they should go. Uh oh! He'll head to the ring. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Now he's been put on the defensive. Position. This takes tremendous power. They're slamming their face down. Right across the knee. Heel oh. up locked in. This is painful. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Delivered with force. Vicious right forearm. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Oh, my goodness. Jam your leg in a bad way.
position you want to be in right now. Ooh, that's the shot to the throat. Shit breaker. Vicious right for him. He's able to combat out of Brock's grip. to overcome the pin attempt. And he's got him by the neck. Look at this! He must have had that scouting. Able to get out of the way. He's starting to struggle here. In order to succeed in extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. This has to be stopped. The cumulative damage here is going to have long-term effects. Shoulder. That'll divorce it. Big time power slam. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Oh, uh, yeah. We should probably clear the way, guys. He fends off the attack. Series of reversals. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. Gun duster. Looking sluggish. Things could be running down for him. There it is. Picture perfect from the rock. Two. Oh, he kicked out. Just inhuman tenacity on display from Brock Lesnar. He was basically operating on natural instinct with that kick out. Rock might need to dial up a little more electricity than usual. If that wasn't enough. We are seeing an unbelievable performance in front of us. And how these competitors are still surviving. Superman punch! And he packs a well. The hand of the table cinches it in, putting his opponent to sleep with the guillotine. He got in there. Thunder got locked in. There's the save. How close was that? Nasty stop to finish it off. And we see the attention being put on the torso area. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. Throwing down the proverbial gauntlet. Where is this going to go next? No clue what he hopes to find down there. Setting him up for the flatline. Nasty shot, and now the blood is flowing from Roman's face. Big counter from Reigns. Forcing his foe into the deep waters. He turns it around. Arm trap. Endless knee strikes. With a velocity into the table. Headlock applied. Tossed without regard. Back elbow blows that one out. Watch the quickness on this. Oh, snap suplex. Not with the arm clutch into the. Oh, and did he take the ride? Leave the side. Jeez. And now I see some blood on the Undertaker's face. Up into the fireman's carry. And. Delivered into the barricade. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Kick to the gut. Uh-oh. Fist directly to the gut. Great job refocusing the reverse now. The WWE Universe is showing their appreciation for the action they're seeing. And this is going to be it! Huge. Ooh. Brock is stopping at nothing to 
to put Roman Reigns down for good. Here's the proof. Here are your winners, Roman Reigns and the it's The Rock leading the team to victory. Two men with one common goal can be a dangerous thing. They're putting the entire locker room on notice.